in the front line, uh, you get the truth in the front line. U.S. Department of the Interior Secretary Ryan Zinke gets on those front lines of the Ferguson fire. Good evening. Thank you for joining us tonight. I'm Megan Roop. We start with that story. The Ferguson fire, now more than 29,000 acres containment at just 6%. There are two new mandatory evacuations for people living in Yosemite West and the Anderson Valley area. KC24's Dennis Valera joining us live in studio with more on the high profile visit. Megan Zinke commended the thousands of fire personnel on their strategies and hard work so far in this eight day old fire. Now the interior secretary added this is a reminder to look at why we have these massive blazes. The Ferguson fire continued to grow into Saturday, causing more to leave their homes, this time evacuating Yosemite West and Anderson Valley. The whole West has come together. Interior Secretary Ryan Zinke, as well as Congressman Tom McClintock, made a pit stop to incident command this morning to see exactly how resources are being utilized. They only had positive takeaways. We have improved on being more joint. Having the Interior and Department of Ag work with Cal Fire and the Sheriff's Department. Crews continue to build or improve on the containment lines. Steep, rugged terrain remains a big obstacle. Fire officials have said the abundance of dead brush and dead trees have helped the fire spread quickly. We are all stakeholders in making sure we return to healthy forests uh, to make sure we can recreate and recre recreational opportunities. Uh, and it starts with actively manage our force. By actively manage, Zinke is referring to his September order for park superintendents and land managers to be more aggressive in removing burnable fuels to prevent these big fires from even happening. Everyone agrees that active fire management starts by removing the dead timber and vegetation management. Zinke also took a moment today to give his condolences to Braden Varney's family. He died last Saturday fighting this fire. He added Trump also gives his regards. Live in studio, Dennis Valera, KC24, Local News That Matters.